these are the, my new angels. They are called uh, Koi Angels. I don't know if they've already paired off. It looks like they have. There's six, two, four, six. So there's three pairs. I just put in brine shrimp just to see if they would eat, and apparently they are eating. So you see that stuff that's floating is brine shrimp. They are so pretty. That's the sunlight coming in the tank right there at the tank. Oh, they're so nice and big. I don't know when they're going to start breeding since they've basically kind of already paired off, but they're so pretty. I don't know where the other one is, but this is my 16 gallon. They're so pretty. There's the other one right there somewhere behind that uh, coral. So pretty. They say when they start becoming more sexually mature, what happens is they'll have a gopodium. A go I call it a gopo or a go stick. Males and females will both have it right underneath those two anal fins. And what happens is males will be smaller and narrower than the females. And females will be thicker and uh, longer so that she can lay her eggs. And it will be right between her chest cavity basically and her um, dorsal fin. So there's those two, and there's those two. Those are so nice and red. Those are gorgeous, red orange. Gorgeous, gorgeous. I'm so happy I got these. So happy. They are just ugh, absolutely breathtaking. So we'll see what happens in the next few weeks. Whatnot. They've already adjusted very well to this tank. I have clean, pristine waters. Water circulation is great. When they become more, you know, paired off, they'll start fighting with each other just so they'll let others know this is my partner, don't touch them. They're very loyal, very, very uh, monogamous fish. And uh, then, you know, they'll start laying eggs and they say once they start laying eggs, that's when they really start chewing their territory, fighting, killing other fish in the tank. So. Hopefully that won't happen within the next, you know, two nights or anything like that. But if that happens, mm, I already have a plan B. I have a frugal edge. I have already started to put back together. Oh, dear. Okay. They're chichlids, and they are what they call sometimes asshole fish. <laughs> I don't know why they call them angels, but they do. I mean, they are pretty, but... Asshole fish is basically a better term for these chichlids. And also how they say they can sex them is by the shape of their heads. You see how this one has more of a dome and this one's more flat? Male, female. And each fish has, like this one has either a dome. This one more of, oh, uh, let's see. Come on, show me your face. Oh. Oof. They're starting to spar, I guess. I don't know. But if anything happens, I'll know what to do. This is cool. Very, very interesting. Maybe they're just trying to fig oop, figure out the uh, territory marks and whatnot. They say they should be in a 55 gallon. Eventually, I will get up to that. Just no time soon, because, well, this dresser can fit a 55 but mom won't like it so i'm very excited i love my fish